Did you already order? Yeah. I went to Burger King and the stupid cheese stick wrap is, uh, I just want like a four piece cheese stick. Yeah, that's it. What is it? Nine. For a four piece cheese stick. Okay, for three. Yeah. Or, sorry, I thought they were like three bucks, but okay. Yeah. Three, six, nine. Okay. 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 I'm at the rallies now because Burger King packaging's messed up. I don't know. I'm just having one of them days. Uh, four piece. Yeah, three fifty nine. She's right. She's right. Yeah, I went to him. My kid is cheese sticks, and the bottom of the bag is just a hole, and it's like boop, all over the floor. I'm like, no, you ain't eating those. So. I'm all by myself, guys. No, no collector club members this week. I sent invites. I'll be at the house in about five or ten minutes. Saw GT in here. Five minutes. Yo, Beckerman, what up, man? Puppy. What up, Birdman? Yeah, yeah the, the stupid bird thing, man. It's just... Today's been chaotic. I already ordered if you want to order. Uh, oh, you're loaded. Four piece. Yep, that's it. Okay, great. Thank you. All right, we're out of here. I'll be at the house soon. I'll show you all some books. Uh, I guess everybody's busy this week, man. I thought somebody might show up. I know um, Bleaker's, I think he's hanging out with Mon and them middle of nowhere and uh guess alan you alan usually shows up and d usually shows up so i just kind of expected they would All right, we're on our way back. Cheat, I've been cheese sticked. I could eat some uh, chicken wings after the show. I dropped the link in the chat. Um. Post comment. No, no, no. Bang. All right.
The good, the bad, the ugly. Good, the bad, the ugly. I like how this phone lights your face up without having to use a light. That's pretty good, man. So all my club members abandoned me. <laughs> all by myself, man. Fuck. I started a little late, but I didn't start late enough to where they could be like, we didn't know what was happening, you know? Like, they just didn't come. Did anything good to eat? No, nah, Melody and Bug wanted something fast, and I'm like, I buy, I'll, I'll eat groceries. Like, I got hot wing groceries I'll heat up later. I can eat chip and dip. I can eat gummy worms. I can eat, uh, we got corn on the cob. We got ham for Easter. We got all types of stuff in the fridge. But just to, just to appease them in their hungry bellies, I'll go run to Burger King or McDonald's real quick just to, you know, just so they ain't starving or something. But he could have ate macaroni or uh, pizza or, hamburgers or something but you know he wanted fast food so that's what i did i went and got the fast food i mean this is kind of my fault why nobody showed up i did dip, i did dip on my uh my uh club chat because there was just too many people in it that weren't showing up it wasn't like they weren't showing up it was just like it was just it was too big of a chat I had, you know, three or four people would show up. It just felt like disconnected. It was more about other shit going on than the actual reason I started it. So I just bounced out. I haven't started a new one to make sure. Uh, your abandonment happened after you picked up that Woke 181 biggie. Uh, I, I don't know. Is that what happened? It might have happened. I've been, I've been getting some weird luck since I got that thing. I know that. Weird luck going on. Hey man, I'm still here trying to trying to be friendly, and uh, I told him while I was like, you know, I appreciate y'all being here, and I'll, I'll send invites to the people that usually show up. That's what I did. I didn't just be like, hey, that's it, we're done with this show. I told him I ain't quitting. I'm not gonna quit. Uh, those cheese sticks, man. What a shame, dude. The ones from um. Burger King are only like a couple bucks, and they're actually a little bit better than the rally ones. And the rally ones are like almost four dollars for cheaper fucking ones, but it was just too big of a line for me. I don't think it's in there though. I don't like to smoke around. Jump, big dog. All right, Bub. I had to go to rallies to get your cheese stick. You don't like your cheeseburger? Can we get it? I'll eat the cheeseburger if you don't like it. Does he not like it? He don't like it. All right, I'll eat it. He ate half my Whopper. Oh, well. Onion, tomato, and lettuce. Burger King's line was filled all the way but they'll give me a, a refund tomorrow they'll give me more like all right let's get the club set up there's there will be a club regardless i can the, sure i just eat the late start uh, ah. shit it's stuck in there Oh, God. These are regular. Good, huh? And I'm little. I love these. Yep, no guests yet. I don't think anybody's going to try to show.
Did they choose to be smashed so you could put your fingers in them? In the hole? I'm coming, guys. I'll be there in a second. That's a hundred dollars. Oh. All right. There we are, and here I am. Where'd my cheeseburger go? Oh yeah. He took a bite of it and was like, nah, I'm good. Nah, let me rip off the party bit. Oh, oh okay. I always show up for you, Biggie. You are always a good friend. Right now, you're my family member as a brother. Oh, that's really nice of you, Birdman. I don't see my. <clears throat> Is that it? Yeah, there they are. Is that hi, Leah? How's the burger? It's okay. No one too bad. A little rodeo. A little rodeo. Oh. All right. Well, I guess I'm going to run it by myself. Heary, heary, all club members. The good, the bad, the ugly. Um, I was doing some Nerf gun stuff today. I'm showing my kid some... Uh, daddy's old nerf guns he all of a sudden he got into the i want weapons phase right i was like oh we don't have to go to walmart we don't have to get any i got i got bags of that stuff right so i pulled this jewel out check it out i'll show you all 
this is um it's called the illuminator y'all should see the rocks we got on the gemstones for easter so it lights up i don't know if y'all can see that but it lights up and it shoots these glow in the dark discs right and it's better than darts because man he zipped through them all there's only two left i had six when we started now i got two um but uh it shoots like a motherfucker like bow so it's no like it's probably one of the coolest ones they'll, they'll shoot about 40 50 feet bro easy this is a little glow in the dark uh oops. Well, shit, where'd it go? Damn it. There it is. Well, that's, that's a different one. But, yeah, man. Two of them. bang um i don't know there's probably more darts over here i had at least four or five before we started no nope, only two shit that's what happens when i leave it at home Let's turn them this one it lights up he likes to lighten up ones so that's what you got to see today. All right, maybe I'll get in the mood a little bit more if I click my banner again. Um, boom, 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 boom. Oh, I thought that was a uh, one thing. I think I sent sent you and Hialeah link. What up, LCS? Good to see you. I wish I knew David's uh, email. I told him I'd invite him, but I don't know his email. I forgot to message him before I started. It's all right. I got some books to talk about. Hope everybody's ready for Easter. I hope uh, you got all your Easter stuff. You got, you should see these rocks. I got them. Did he about to set TD Jakes up? Uh oh. So we'll talk about the one eighty one. and um a couple other books i 
I usually cut these fingertips off. It kind of sucks doing this without my... Oh, I got a guest. Hold on, guys. Someone showed up. It's Aaliyah. What up? Can you hear me? Did I mute you? <laughs> you muted me. What's up? How you doing? Oh, I didn't mute you, did I? I think so, but it was no big deal. Uh, you, If I muted you, you was able to unmute yourself, I think. Yeah, yeah, I did. Okay. So what's up with that glove, man? That glove giving you trouble? Huh? That glove giving you trouble? Yeah, like the fingers are stuck on the inside. Have you ever had a glove do that? Yeah, not that I put on too many gloves, but yeah. Why are you yeah, putting like you on? See how this thumb is like shoved inside itself. What's what's gonna happen with these gloves? I don't know. I, I've I've just gotten uh, to where I like to wear gloves now. All right. Is I it gotta to get my other Bluetooth too. I just Bluetooth sucks. Is it to hand? Is it to handle the the, the books? It does. It, it feels good on your hands when you handle your books. I usually use them to, they're like battling gloves, but I wore them so much now. I just, if I'm doing, a, if I know I'm going to be here a while, I just put them on. I don't have Wait. the ones I like though. These are new gloves. What are, what are battling gloves? It's like whatever you're competing. Like in what? Like when we, when I do the club and we do categories and oh, stuff. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I thought it was for like some kind of sport or something. Like, a, you know, like. Yeah, kind of like a sport. Yeah. Okay. What's going on, man? What's the good, the bad, and the ugly? What's, what's that all about? Well, I thought that I'd have a few people show up and we could do like good books, bad books, and ugly books or something, you know, but not, I don't have a bunch of people on panel this week, so I don't know. Yeah, I, I I was just hanging out. I just saw you by by yourself. I go, oh shit, nobody's on. I gotta come on. Then. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I sent out about fifteen links, so I guess everybody just got busy. Usually, uh, a couple people will show up. I I got the link, but I just wasn't sure when you were going on. That's the only thing. Maybe that's what's up. Oh, I don't know. So why? I'm gonna go get my other Bluetooth. I'll be right back. This this well, one's toast. We got Ben Compton, Pocan. Yeah, I'll be right back. Who that? Brian oh. LCS, Kenneth Bird. We had uh, who else was here? GT, GT, right? Yeah, GT Key Comic, Becker, Beckerman. I don't know who's still here, but welcome, guys. I don't know what exactly what we're gonna be talking about tonight, but uh, I guess it's the good, the bad, and the ugly. I thought. I thought it was going to be something else. I thought he was going to be talking about YouTube channels and go down that one, but I'm glad he's not. So I don't know exactly what we're going to talk about. It's just going to be garbage, I guess. Hey, you uh, still here? I'll try to get my Bluetooth going. That's like the best part about uh, using your phone to stream with is having a Bluetooth. Hold on. Have I done it? I don't think I've ever done that. You have You always use your PC. I wish I had my. Yeah. I think I've gone on people's channels with my phone, but not, not been the host. Not, not, not. I've never been the host like that. I used to host um, a couple shows, but you only use your PC, like we said. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I never used it with. The, I've never hosted on my phone. Right. Yeah, it's not the the most optimal. There we go. Now I'm in pretty good position. It, it's hard to do. I wouldn't have been able to wear these battle in the night. I have to ta I have to tap out the fingers to be able to use them. Maybe I'll do that while we're streaming. If I had a couple more people show up, I'd get a, a battle in. But uh, I don't know if anybody else is coming. Bleaker is uh, doing something with Mon, and um, oh, I saw Alan, that. Yeah, Alan's usually here by now, so. Alan was with, uh, with, uh, oh my God, Collector Six. What's the, um, they doing yeah. it? What's his name, man? I can't think of it. I don't know. Bigby? They do a Friday show now? It, yeah, it's Collector Six. It's not Bigby. It's, um, 
Oh my God, dude. Yeah, he was on earlier. And I think yeah, uh, earlier, but they don't do a show at nine o'clock, I don't think. They started at eight, but they were going, they went a little long. They were showing books and stuff. I caught a little bit of it. Mm. I was I was watching the the NCAA games and on and off watching who's going live. And I, then I saw you that you finally, you went live. So I, I started watching that. But there's quite a few people that are live right now. What's up, Knights of Old? Yeah. When I What's saw that, when I saw the title, <laughs> I thought you were going to do the good, the bad, and the ugly of YouTube channels. And I was like, oh, no. <laughs> oh, that'd be, yeah, I don't think anybody would want to be involved in that. I'm still trying to keep the club going, a normal club show. Yeah. So, yeah, I don't know what we would have done. I just named it good, good, the bad, and the ugly. I, I was thinking that I could use one of them categories. Bad, ugly, good isn't that fun, I don't think. Good might be all right. What's a good book? Like, what the hell does that mean? Well, I hope it's not good girl, man. I'm, I'm oh, my God, yeah. I hope it's not that. Well, shit, I, if Alan's streaming at 9, I can't ever get him on here. If he's got, like, a weekly till well, 9 o'clock. He started, like, at 8, but they were still going, like, at 9. Yeah, nine. I mean, that's what he usually does. They go more than an hour. Fuck, I might not have to have, I might not get Alan on here anymore. What's up, Christina? How are you? There was a, quite a few people going, man. So seems like it's a busy Friday night. I know Jigs yeah. is coming to the tent, so that's well. He's he's been going now Wednesday, Thursdays, and Fridays. Oh, that's nice. Maybe I'll jump every on every night. Him. I haven't been on with him in a in a few weeks. This panel is focused more on the ugly GT. Yeah, I would agree with that. Christina Payne, what up? On the ugly. <laughs> why is that? Why why do you say we're more focused on the ugly? Why would I say it? Cause yeah. I don't know, because we're not like uh, if you got three options, what are you gonna gravitate to? I'm gonna go with the good. The good? Yeah, I don't wanna be the yeah, bad. Good ain't the bad. I, yeah, I don't wanna be bad. I don't wanna be ugly either. I, I think ugly's good. more uh more of a category that's easier to get in, I guess. If I if I was to say which one is easiest to get in. Yeah, ugly. U ugly and good is good. It, or not that bad. Hey, you got your 180. I mean, your 181, right? So how does it feel? It feels good, man. I don't know what I would do after this. I mean, I see people getting books pretty consistently, but... I don't know what the hell I want after that. Like, I'm still kind of in a, like, funk from it. That's not a bad thing, though, man. It's when your collection's already getting to the point where you've got almost everything you really want or you could, you know, reasonably afford. It's not a bad place to be, man. No. Um, I've, I haven't had a book, like, fulfill me enough to where I don't want another book for a while. And I don't know if it's just because I've slowed down a lot. I mean, last year I only got one book, you know? So what was, what was that book? I got the FF 48. Oh, okay. That's right. And that was the only book last year. Really? I mean, I got other shit, but everything I got last year was to get this book. That right. was worth the fuck. I mean, I didn't buy any big books that I kept. I just went for one book. So Those are freaking books in the last two years, though. That's two cool books in the last two years. Yeah, it's like you got FF forty eight and a Hulk one eighty one. I, I think that might be around my pace. Is this one thousand dollar book a year or something? Seems pretty good. It's like almost a hundred bucks a month. You know, it's just I'm saving it towards one book. Yeah, and then and then you get that book, and then it's like, what now, right? It's like <laughs> do I don't do know, dude. I mean, it was there's, different. Yeah, there's huh? always more books because I've always there's I'm down to just a couple of big books myself that I really want. But there's always little books and stuff that you don't necessarily want the slab and you just want them want it raw. There, there can be a theme if you hop on Poke and I just need someone to battle. It's kind of hard to do like one on one, but if someone else came on, we could do uh 
a theme. I don't. Which one do you think we should do? Or I'll I'll drop the link one more time just in case. Yeah. But Let's, um, um, I'm always pubs is in here. Yeah, I'm always expecting to a big book to satisfy me for a long time. Max is like a month though. It is. That's not it's, for me. I was able to hold out for a long time. I, it, well, it used to be a month for me, and now it's just like I'll get little books from the LCS and the um, antique shop, but I don't sell any to. Once I heard that uh, you guys fill out W twos and tax forms if you make too much money on PayPal, I was just like, all right, I'm out. I haven't. Is that had, a thing? I haven't. I haven't. I haven't had to do that. I don't sell that much anymore, so I don't know what the limit is before you have to start worrying about it. Well, they had that thing a couple of years ago where it, on eBay that it was six hundred dollars forever. No, I'm sorry, it was you had a, you didn't have to fill anything unless it was like over twenty thousand dollars, and then they were gonna they passed that law or something there, and it was gonna be six hundred dollars. Then you would have to fill out a form, but that shit's been delayed. I thought it was going to be this year, but then I got something from eBay. Hey, unless it's been delayed and all that, so I still haven't had to do anything. I sell at Cod Sub uh, and pay taxes. Yeah, yeah. I don't think that I want to go down the I pay taxes route. I mean, one year I probably made about shit like six or seven grand or some shit. And I was like, damn, that was pretty unexpected, you know? Mm -hmm. And uh, after that, I got a little bit nervous when I started hearing the $600 and the $2,000 and shit like that. I was just like, eh, I'll just play it light, you know? Yeah, no, I haven't had to do anything yet. So. Oh, we got two more people in the back. Sweet. What yeah. kind of category should we do? Okay. Lady F. Nice. What's up, gentlemen? Good oh. to see you. Thanks oh, for having me. We can still club around, sweet. Uh, and it'll be fair because none of us are prepared for what the books are. God damn oh, right. That's fine. <laughs> yeah. All right. The good, the bad, the ugly. What if we did them all in one run? Like a cover with good, bad, and ugly. Good, bad, and ugly? Is there a way? Can you? I mean, I like doing complicated shit, but do you think that's possible, Pokemon? I don't think it's impossible. I think we can justify it in some way, shape, or form. Yeah, I if we, if, huh? I got one already. If if we could just find one out of five that makes sense, that's pretty fucking impressive. So I say we do good, bad, and ugly. Right. Good, bad, and ugly. All right. All right. So we'll all go for them. Unless one of y'all just want to judge, but I'm gonna go get some books. Good, bad, and ugly. Yeah, I'm gonna go find some books too. Yeah, find some book books. How many do we need? Is it one or two? Five. Five, five books. Many. I got one. The good, the bad, the ugly. I don't know if I have any ugly with my good and the bad. Yeah, I don't know, man. Okay, okay, okay. Slow <laughs> it right on top, too. Holy shit. Let's see what I just got right here. Uh, damn, this started. This 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 escalated. Oh, thank you guys for joining. I was look. It was looking pretty bleak there for a minute. I was just like, "Fuck!" I don't know if anything's gonna happen. No, no, man. Oh yeah, this could work, baby. You don't have to get five, you know, it two if you only get a couple, that's fine. Make it work. Oh, no. I might Oh yeah. All right, all right. Let's excellent book. It's the inferno theory. I got two. I got three. I got three. Good bragging. 
I'm not beating you guys in this, bro. I think I got this one. I got you guys. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I got you guys, dude. I'm, yeah, I'm yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I gotta go look. Uh oh, we're picking up. Oh, He'll be back in. Cliff, yeah, yeah, get on here, Cliff. I'm having a big I bet maybe Big U was trying to get Cliff in and he accidentally exited himself. Uh, oh. This is not the best YouTube content right here, but hey, we're looking for books. We're looking for the good, the bad, and the ugly. Oh, I don't want to break up some cool stuff, but I got three. I don't know if I'm gonna look that. Depending on how we define this, I don't know what I got. <laughs> <laughs> That's like your book. You got to find a way to do it. Two yeah. seconds. <laughs> In chat, we got uh, Dope Comics. What's going on, Dope? I love that dude's shorts. He's got the best shorts in the game. Bubs is in here. What's going on, Bub? I got four. I got four. My man, right. Cliff on Comics with Shaken, Ben Compton. Thank you all for coming. Enjoy having you here. The theme is Big, Bad, and Ugly. We're running the comic books. Son of a bitch. We got an avalanche of guests. Hold on. It worked, guys. We're making it work. Making it work. We got one more. I think it's just one more. Okay. Cliff's here. Let's give him a chance to uh, get a book. Yes. Cliff. What's up, good Cliff? to bad to ugly, man. Hop in, dude. Can you grab five good to bad to uglies? So all three things have to be on the cover. Good or do you want to just judge this round? I could just judge. Yes, that's the way we're doing it I, this round. I literally just showed up. Okay, like, I'll just judge. Sweet. They're all in it. Look at Pokan Joe yeah. in, his, in his masculine the jumpsuit. What the fuck was that? Jumpsuit. I had a gr I'm Italian, right? I had a. I had a fantastic <laughs> Mr. Sinister story I was telling when I when my uh my damn phone died right i was just over here blabbering about I was... give me about right, a minute I'll all right that's something Yo, I'll I'll see what happens. happens didn't i just see you on alan's channel get your get your butts over here you i got about? four unless alan's not done i mean i'm gonna be respectful that's all right maybe they just wanted they had a five. spur of the moment i got two i got three so far i'm almost ready right. so Let i'll give you all my miss I'll give you all my Mr. Sinister story I was telling when the phone died. Okay. So I think it was Art Adams' uh, X Men cover, maybe. And uh, it was the Inferno series. All right. Mm -hmm. yeah. And uh, Mr. Sinister, like, grabbed Jean up and kissed her. And it pissed Cyclops, Cyclops off so much, he blew him into, like, dust. I don't know if you ever read that, but I was just like, what in the fuck? What is that, how, that ain't how he died. It was Inferno issue. I don't know. It was like a white cover, and Storm had like uh, G-string ragged ass panties on, and and it was, was fucking... X Men. Yeah, yeah. Fucking awesome. Uh, I got five. I got, I got four. Five. I'll just play my four. Um, one, two. Four. Oh, okay, okay. I got, I got five. All right, I got, I got five. All right, I'll start. All right, do it. Sweet. Thank you guys for joining. Um, I need some, some of this stuff right here. Alan, what up? Get in here. You can make the second round. All right. So annual one has got to have 
someone good, bad, and ugly on here. Let's see. We'll say Spider Man's good. Uh, Mysterio's bad, and Sandman's ugly. Mysterio is really bad because I should call Mysterio ugly because my Mysterio is all ripped up by tape. <laughs> so Mysterio's ugly. Spider Man's pretty good, and Electro's bad. So there's my first book. There you go. All right. Um, the, the the dude is bad. The chick is good, and the the swamp guy is ugly. True. Base. So very good. The the dude is bad for taking his chick to a swamp to make out, and the swamp guy is uglier in hell. All right. Bad call. Um, some more romances. I don't have three characters, so I'm just going to say this was an ugly situation. And nice. kind of look like he's taking a piss, but you're I like that, like, Biggie. You know? I like what issue number is that, my man? Girl Romance 143. Yeah, like how it. is Silver Surfer 75 on the back of that? <laughs> well, this book is clearly the big book out of the two, right? You got to put the big book on the front. Incredible. Yeah. All right. The good, the bad, the ugly. So, shit, these all look good. Okay, so I'll say Gambit's good, Magneto's bad, and Patch without his hand is ugly. Yo, I haven't seen this all week. And, like, I haven't, like, it's just one of those books that I love, and, like, this week it's just been everywhere. It's been popping, yeah. The Age of Apocalypse stuff has been... And I have six of them in my bedroom. And I think this is my best example of good, bad, and ugly. Um, but one character's bad and ugly is the only problem. Um, the marine good guy and the ugly, <laughs> ugly yeah. bad. That is a great cover. That's, that's awesome. When did that come out, man? Oh, this is like forty-one or something. Green this is Center. really old. But... It's a beautiful. It's like a Chinese racist octopus. It's fucked. Yes. Up. <laughs> It's tent it's tentacle cover and a flamethrower cover at the same time. Oh so you God. get it. Yeah, it's pretty good. All right. All right. All right. All right. I got this shit, dude. All right. My first book. I got the good is Thor, the bad is Enchantress, and the ugly is the executioner. Nice. Damn, That's you went hard on that one. I like it. This one's better, bro. They're going to keep getting harder. Look at this. <laughs> the good, I got Iron Man. The bad, I got Frost. And the ugly is Happy Hogan. And I even got a beauty. And that's Pepper Pot. So this one's got four. <laughs> Suck up. So far, now, Thor has been your best. Dude, I'm kicking ass. Wait, this one's good too, but I kind of did a biggie. One character is both. But it's actually pretty good because I got the good, the bad, and the ugly, and she's the beauty hater. Who's it? Right. The beauty hater is the ugly? And, and the, the, bad? the bad and the ugly because, you know, she's got a mask. She's a beauty hater, so you know she's ugly as hell, you know? So, All right. This one's right. even better. This one I got the good is Dr. Strange. Mm -hmm. The bad is right here, and then I got the ugly is the torch, and the thing is the Beatles. <laughs> Good Lord. But you know, I'm giving you that one. All right. Good job. Uh, this is the best one, bro. I got the good are the Beatles, the bad is the blue meanie, and then Jeremy's the ugly. <laughs> I got it, bro. I'm winning this. You guys better vote for these. are all good books. Well, I'm scoring you right now, dude. And I'm like, you got you got two big hits in there, two good ones, and one that is like just there. Good job, Hylia. All good right. Job. My first one is the Avengers number 25. The good being the Avengers, the bad being Dr. Doom, and the ugly being that horrible cover right there. Look at that. That is ugly. <laughs> That's fair. That's fair. <laughs> I like the cover, but you are you're you're pushing it with the cover is ugly. I know. <laughs> Next one is Rainbow Bright and the Star Stealer number one. Oh, I shit, almost picked that, Joe. The Shut the fuck up! I almost bought is that. Is Rainbow book. Bright the bad? 
is of course the bad guys and the ugly is this horrible looking design here in the background i don't know who came up with that that's crazy I almost got that book I almost thought it was. <laughs> Shit. next one is the penguin number six the bad is the penguin mm -hmm. the good it's still the penguin it's a good cover <laughs> it's a legit good cover you're pushing it Pushing and the it. ugly is, I don't know why they did this. Penguin. Blue the ball ugly right is the here. penguin. Yeah, he's suffering from blue ball. I don't know why that's there. That's ugly. It's just sticks. Yeah, this, is, this one's your low ball. <laughs> Next, good, bad, and ugly. We got the bad, the monsters, right? King Kong, Godzilla, good, the superheroes, the ugly. It didn't need to be a foily. Oh, God. I just. <laughs> you, are, you, are, you, are, you are reaching. You are reaching, sir. <laughs> and I don't think your scores are looking mighty fine right now. <laughs> next one is Hawkman number five. The good being Hawkman, the bad being Shadow Thief, and the ugly is that grade. Oh my god, a 4.5. That's the lowest grade I have in all my books. I'll oh, stop it. <laughs> it as long as it presents beautifully, you're good to go. <laughs> well, that's what matters. I'll have to smile while I'm holding it. <laughs> oh, my calculator's not working. I'm so angry. All right. I take, I take judging very seriously. Should I sing a song or something right now? Of yeah, of course. Why do you burn? All right. Me up here. The good guy is on the ground. The bad guy is death. And that boxer is fucking ugly. I mean... Lady F is not wrong. Okay. Good, bad, ugly. There's that. The good are the invaders, and the bad and ugly is the Nazi Frankenstein. I like it. I that like is both it. bad and ugly. You should neither be a Nazi, and it's preferable if you're not a monster. Uh, we can work with that. Um, the good in this is Amadeus Cho, the bad is Lady Hellbender, and the ugly is Fin Fang Foom. Ha! Huh? All right, that one's cute. The good is Kamandi, the bad Ooh. is the Tiger People, and the ugly are the Presidents. The good is Superwoman, the bad is Zatanna, and the ugly is Yeti. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna round that out for my love of Supergirl and Zatanna. That's all right, that's it. That's all I got. Oh, lady up, you're doing good. That's one, bro. Nowhere, man. Jeremy is the ugly. The Where is he? Well, the they're is, quibbling. Everybody after they went, uh, Cliff. I'm such a prick. Aaron, they're quibbling. Minus All right. points. Oh, your I'm, turn. I'm, I'm cracking myself up. Do it the bad and the ugly. So, are you ready for my scores? Yeah. Well, you just pick one, and the person you pick gets two points. Oh, but you okay. Can score. This, yeah, yeah. this round goes to Lady F. Oh, come on. Listen, her oh, first oh. two, her fir your first one was a banger. Actually, she beat you by four, point four points, Hylia. Point oh, four. Stop. This book should win it automatically, bro. I, I do not care about the Beatles any which way, so that had no special bonus for me. Good. The bat, the blue meanie is the bat, all time your be bat. Your best, your best one was the Thor in my book. Oh no way, no way, no way. Good, your, bad, worst ugly. Was, your worst one was that Hulk. <laughs> Good, bad, ugly. Bad, ugly. Ali is like, no, I think everybody did good. Yeah, I liked them all. Yeah. You had great, Joe. I fucking nearly picked that book. Joe, I appreciate your creativity on Rainbow Bites, but she did not knock it out of the park for me. 
I know. I got these two badass ones. I'm never good at these and, things. And and Biggie, they were they were those. I, yeah, Biggie, those two were your best ones. Yeah, probably. You know, you did tie you did tie with Hialeah, but but Lady F gave me three covers that I really appreciated. That which ones? To the top. Which ones were the appreciated ones? Um, Supergirl and the first two, which are now suddenly escaping me because Batman. I'm, yeah, Batman was great. Incredible. Forgettable, that's why they're escaping. And the evaders, no, dude, I'm suffering from allergies and I'm tired, that's why I had to make notes. Hey, Hialeah, <laughs> escape <Wow>. these nuts. <laughs> oh my god, I remember the last time I was threatened like that. I'm like 12, I'm sorry, <laughs> got like the attitude of a 12. Just, you had good I, mean, I, I don't think I pushed the ugly envelope hard enough. I think that we all showed too good of books. We need to show some ugly quarter bin bullshit this time. So now, does this one, does this round, do you want to do some just fucking ugly, some fuglies? Let's just do some fucking dirtbag quarter bin books or something. I, I but I mean, they don't have to be bad. Not, what would you show? I'm supposed to ratio <laughs> the ugliness of true ugliness. That's too pretty to be ugly. Yeah, that's yeah, some Kirby magic. <laughs> if it's so ugly, give that shit to me. <laughs> yeah, let's go with. Uh, or do you want to go with like really bad ones or cheap ones that are good? Like I'm, I want to, I don't want to mess it up. Like underrated, underrated quarter or, dollar bin fodder, or just like absurd books, ridiculous. Um, oh, yeah, kind of. That would be good too. Like, really, if it's if it's comically bad, where it's like a really bad cover, like a lay fill Captain America, I think that should get extra points. Hey, did Alan ever join us? Because he said he'll join. Yeah, he's he said he's coming. Okay, because I'm thinking I'm come with some bangers. Yeah, can um, I show you guys what I found in the fifty cent bin today? Yeah, sure. we'll take an intermission. I found this X Men Limited ash can. 49 cents actually a piece this defenders um valkyrie number two it's a a b cover you can see that because yeah, it's a, yeah that's, the, the series that came before the order oh, that's, a, um, that's a nice cover yeah thanks um thanks buddy i was looking for that damn inferno book so i could show y'all it's uh eric larson um yeah i'm, not gonna, I'm not gonna i'm not gonna hate on that because of Eric larson um i picked this up in I'll the 50 cent bin um i've been trying to complete this uh run Infamous Iron Man, number oh, eight. The maker. Nice. Yeah. And I've been also trying to complete this run, Earth's Mightiest Avengers. So I got number eight. I love that Hercules right there, man. That is cool. Rip ready, like ready to go. And then I also found number 11. Um, and then those were all my, uh, those were all my 50 cent bin finds. Okay. Yeah, Ash Can. Nice. It was Ash like, cans, it's, Ash cans. 2099 limited, but it has the X-Men 2099 on it. So I was just like, but inside it's prints. It's like it, it's awesome. I can actually show you. Uh, it shows like the layouts of all like the covers and shit. Um, yeah, here's some. They show like the layout. Uh, it's just all kinds of crazy. But the did y'all see that book DS sold tonight? That today, that Dave Stevens, holy shit! What was that? One twenty three or something? Uh, what did he sell? Sell? Oh, if, if no one else saw it, he sold like a, a Dave Stevens cover where it was like a, I dream a genie chick and he's drawing her. Got it. No, on, it's on a comics uh, journal one seventeen. Comic journal one seventeen. Yeah, yeah. Shit, I muted you. DS has got the best shit. It, they said it, it was thirty five hundred or best offer. It was a fucking stupid expensive. It was nine point six. There was only like six in the world on census. Yeah, I believe D DS has some of the best shit I've ever seen. Period. Well, I'm surprised he sold that too, man. At that amount of money, dude, you could get crazy book. Yeah, like it's it. What up, Alan? Did you see that book DS had? I think you might have liked that one. Which one? Which the comic journal 117, the Dave Stevens, where the girl looks like uh, I Dream a Genie chick. Where, where he's oh, I have that. Yeah, I have that, too. It's oh, you like do a, have that. I have all the Dave Stevens covers. Nice. Every one of them. Did you yeah. know Dave Stevens did a what if? He oh. um, like did the 
interiors for like what if 16. Yeah, I guess he did a lot of inking for other artists. Uh, he did also Star Wars. Did he? I didn't know that. Like, I'd never known that he worked on anything Marvel. Yeah. All right. I, I was surprised by that too. I just watched uh, the documentary about him. Did you? Uh, drawn perfectly. They were talking about that. that um, really good. And I enjoyed that. So we're, we're showing books this round that you're embarrassed you even own. All right. I got a few of those. All right. All right. Like really bad crap comics is the worst okay. you can find. Okay. All right. Got it. All right. I'm going to skip this one and I'll give you back. Okay, I'm gonna. I'll if, it's a, if it's a P Diddy comic, I'll give you an extra two points on my scoring. Oh my god! <laughs> Highly is like I don't have any crap books, so I can't do this. Dude, I, 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 it'll be hard. I, yeah. <laughs> okay, I'll be back. <laughs> All right. Yeah. I'm go I'm, I'm, I got crap books. Just be a judge, Violia. Like, you you shithead. He's, he's off to do something. That's okay. Oh, okay. Sorry, buddy. And being mean, being. I don't think he's leaving. He's just coming back. I don't know. He's to... All right. So, man, really bad books. Sheesh. I wish I could find that uh, facsimile of that X Factor, the Ren and Stimpy one. Because why would you have a reprint of that bullshit? Fucking X Factor book. Yeah, I have no idea. I read a book, and since it wasn't like a big key, I just shoved it somewhere, and now I don't know where I put it. So, oh, I've run into trouble, and I just shove it somewhere. If it would have been like a bigger book, I would have probably known where I put it, but it was so small. It was just like, it was a great story, though. I don't know if it's canon. I don't know how... Mr. Sin maybe does Mr. Sinister like live in like a imaginary world sometimes like it's not really him you know what I mean no there's a, but there's a lot of crazy versions of him he has running around hmm. well it seemed like in the new cartoon on uh x-men 97 like he was making people hallucinate and trip and think that they, they were in worlds they weren't yeah, no, so, that, was, that was just that was just uh, that was just clone genes, psychic power, just amped. Oh, so it was fucking genes, breeze. Oh, oh Madeline, right? Yeah, her. It was all her, and that's oh. why Gene. And that's why Gene was able to stop her. It wasn't like you know she actually made Inferno happen. She just well, she did. She just made you know. I hate, I kind of don't like that. Whenever you're reading a book and you think, man, that's really neat. Someone died, but it, it ends up being like their imagination or some shit. You know, it's like, oh, what the fuck am I even doing reading it? The X ninety seven did a great job of taking some very messy stories and turning it into one good episode. Were really bad comic books. I don't know if this one will count, but oh, you can't put Dreadstar in a bad comic. Dag on it. What am I going to put in a bad comic, man? Oh, this is a bad one. What's a bad comic, uh, Cliff? A bad X comic. Uh, yeah, the yeah. New Guardians from DC. The New Guardians from DC. Uh, yeah. You know, I got one of them. Which we'll introduced Hemogo Hemogoblin, um, who is a vampire that gives you AIDS. Um, oh, that's right. New Guardians number one. Yeah. yeah. And it also gave us Snowfire, whose powers come from snorting cocaine. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Snowflame. Cool. Snowflame. And Estranio, Estranio, which was such a horrible portrayal of a gay man with AIDS with superpowers. That oh. they reworked the character 12 times to try to make up for it. And he's now like a low key Doctor Strange in DC. All right. I got five pretty bad books. <laughs> By the way, I love that when they DC made all the votes for the titles you want to see a couple of years ago, and Justice League Q for Queer was one of them, and it got just trash. But even though it never made it in the polls, um, in the Pride special for that year, Estranio assembles the Justice League queue to battle Eclipso. Ah, yikes. I, I, I'm going to take out this new Warriors issue, but it was on the list. All right. Here we go. 
five books. This is uh, Alien Nation number one. Oh, that's a great book. Oh come on! <laughs> I loved that movie. Yep, that's a, that's a that's a weirdo one. I like it. Pain. From that's who? pretty bad. Harris Cox. Yeah. My buddy, uh, Shockwave Nostalgia, would take a book like this and he would like put it on a short box, like just cut out the shit and ruin them. Just kind of perfect book for that. Have you ever read this? No, I've never. It's fucking horrible. It's like animals fucking each other, bestiality. Hmm. Well, there's a lot of books like that. And this one's from Image. So, yeah. Some people like it. It's tooth and claw, but literally that's what it is. It's like animorphs just having sex. Kind of like uh, a natural. Shaquille like O'Neal. Yeah, y'all ain't going to like this book. What hey. on earth is that? You know what? That's a good one, too. I don't know. I, I mean, who wants a Shaq comic, right? I do. I, mean, I, lo I love it, I mean, but most people would think it's bad. No, I, I love it. No. Yeah, I love it, but most people probably wouldn't think it's that great. Wild and then Star. that's probably the best book out of all of them, really. Wildstar. It kind of is. I think everybody's got that in a long box someplace. It's a it's yeah. a look, it's a newsy too. <laughs> yeah. I like the Shaq one though. I can't I ain't going I don't know if Lady F's ready. Yeah, sorry. She's probably still going. Wait, you ready, oh. Pokemon? Yeah. All right. So I got uh, Marvel Spidey and his amazing friends. Mm. <laughs> so bad. Uh, cooking with Onsters. This this thing is trash. It's like a ripoff of Pokemon. And yeah, that was, that was mm, that's bad. That's like Monsters the Drink logo. Yeah. Wow. This is Mandrake project this is from an old rocker from the 70s and i'm telling you right now besides its odd shape it's trash <laughs> it's so trash it's like a 70s heavy metal song where they sing about dragons and shit like that it's so bad what in the hell is that that is <laughs> rough so bad uh the terrible elizabeth dunn against the devils in suits this is not what you like. Fucking bad. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> so, That's good. Okay. Pokan, Pokan's coming strong this time. He is. He really is. Right. <laughs> when you have a weekly comic book review, you'll read some trash. <laughs> mm. uh, next is something I, I picked up in a uh, blind box. Um, it's Next Avengers number two. Um, and it's just, just nobody a book that nobody cares about that I just got stuck with and I can't get rid of it <laughs> to save my mm. life. Right, homage. Mm, that was like not that, as, that was not as bad as the others. That's the best part of it, it's an homage. Yeah. Yeah, I like homage. <laughs> yeah, get a closer look at that homage. <laughs> it is probably that is pretty trash art. <laughs> that is some trash art up there. I'm sorry. I mean, it's bad, but it's not Romita Junior bad. So like. Mm. Mm. Bad. So in this case, we're we're gotta compliment your books and say that they're really awesome because they're just too good to be. Because you're trying bad. to win. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Joe, Joe, you you got, you, got awesome. some, you got the lead in my book by a smidgen. All right. Nice. <laughs> okay. Let's go with Alan. Right. So we got some life out. Nine oh, dollars. that's bad. Oh, my that's God. Bad. Oh, immediately, yeah. immediately. You know the way to my heart of disgust. You really do. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So that's... Well, that's kind of like the first, uh, what is it? What's his hell's his name? The Kirby? It's probably, it's probably F something, F but it's like lame. F okay. I forget the number. Oh, well. And then this one, I'd even bag and board it, even though I bought it. But, you know, it's just, I got this in a 50 cent bin or something. That is horrible, shot. horrible there. I'm yeah. thinking of the Inhumans character after the first Inhumans. Was it Black Bolt? Yeah, I think that's like a Black Bolt homage, that brigade. And this one could be an awesome book, but somebody ate it. Look at that. <laughs> like somebody actually oh, ate it. Oh, yeah. But it's that's a, a perfect candidate. A nervous condition that they're like eating comics. Mm. Terrible. It's missing like a huge piece out of here too. Somebody was really damn. Hungry. They were hungry. <laughs> they, that must have been a delicious <laughs> yeah. comic. 
you know? Yeah. Also, almost also, there's like a hint of homophobic homoeroticism on that cover, so that's gonna <laughs> definitely do for me. I don't, I don't see that, but okay, sure. No, because like she's all she's sexualized, but he's like angry and not interested. So I can see where well, this he is missed going. his boat. He missed his boat. That's why. Oh, of course. Which any any man that was interested in a woman wouldn't be mad about missing the boat, but he's mad because all the dudes <laughs> are in the boat without him. <laughs> Okay, mm. and now this is one of my worst ones. It is just okay, so you can see it. Actually, it's a nice cover. Okay. Oh, I could have done some crazy shit. Uh, what's going on? Back cover. It's just, it's just, it's just the front cover. Oh. <laughs> That's it. That's all there is. That's pretty bad. That's pretty, That's bad. pretty bad. Do you have a lot and of then, those? Oh, you got uh, one more. Okay. No, I just just happened to it was that one. Lot, but I got man. Now this one is the worst comic in my entire collection. Maybe I hate this. I actually hate this comic the most of any book that I have in my collection. Street Sharks, number one. Uh, <laughs> don't wow. hate. Appreciate. Wow. There's wow. a joke. You know, yeah. you know, only, you only know how to would understand. Was that the dumb yeah. book that beat you? That wasn't the yeah, same this one. This is the dumb book that beat me with my. Uh, Damn, it's the exact same one. Yeah, well, I didn't. Well, it's, I bought. Yeah, I bought my copy of it. Yeah. I mean, it's the same cover. That's what oh, I meant. Yeah. Yeah, same cover, yeah. So this All right, this, this comic you. beat my Wonder Woman one. <laughs> so, <laughs> fucking stupid. So I, I, I literally know, bought Alan, it just so I could throw it. <laughs> Alan and Joe. Yeah, you should beat the hell out of it. Yeah. Oops. <laughs> so, yeah. So that's, um, those are my five. So that, I think that's it, right? I've got four I can show, but I don't have PDF five. Snaps, okay. Uh, this was tough for me. I uh, didn't know what to do. So I... Um, Here's an Avengers. It's busy as fuck. 316. Just so much going on. I hate shit like that. It's just ugly to me. Whatever. Uh, I've always hated this X-Men cover. Thought it's underwhelming. Oh, yeah. It's ugly. I never liked that one either. Yeah, it just turns me off. It makes me uh, angry. Awesome. It makes <laughs> me angry. Look at his eyes. He's all creepy. And stuff, right? So fucking cool. It has a bit of scooby doo to it. I don't like it. Uh, no. this men in black. Oh, the it, men in black is trash. Good it's job. Ugly as shit. Yeah, that, that is pretty bad, actually. And then I had to get this for the camp, but it's kind of ridiculous. This is not William Shatner. Oh, Tech World. That's it's okay. Fun. William Shatner isn't William Shatner. That's all right. But you know, so those are my picks. They're good. I mean, all right. Bad. So Biggie, for the sake of my scoring. What do I do? Do I just divide by four because Lady F doesn't have a fifth one? No, you could you could give her if you felt like her books were better than her four were better than five. You could just go with her. You know, it's just whoever you like the most, I guess. Okay. She could show one book and still win. Okay. You don't have to have five. Okay, show yours real quick. I missed you. All right. Me? Pokan. Pokan. Okay, hold on. I had the um, the terrible Elizabeth done against the devils in suits. Trash. <laughs> it's trash. Uh, the Mandrake Project, more trash from a 70s rocker that's all coked out. Mm -hmm. The story reads that way. Yeah, that was great. Yeah. Cooking Oyster Monsters, a ripoff of Pokemon, and it comes off as a ripoff. Terrible. Love it. Yeah. Spidey's amazing friends. This is trash. Absolutely. If you are not, if you are over the age of five, it's trash. Yeah. And uh, Avengers next, uh, number two. And just, that one was the one that I actually kind of liked just a little bit. You can't I actually like, like that, book. that actually art, like dude. What is going on there? Okay. I mean, out of all the books, I probably like that one the most. <laughs> and is that is that Jane Foster? Yes. yes. No, that's uh, yeah. Yeah. the child. It's Lita. Thor's oh. daughter. Oh fuck. Oh, it's Thor's daughter. Oh yes, because this is the MC2 universe. Oh, that's uh, funny. Trash. That makes it a little bit worse. The better question is, why do you even <laughs> that one came from a blind box from a at a Kansas City Comic Con? Wow. All right, well I'll recap since yeah. all right. My, mine was pretty crap. Wild Star. I'm gonna take the shack out, but I'll keep the alienation. You know, no, don't jack out. That that was good. Well, this one's even worse because he it's child abuse. Well, that's horrifying. That's child abuse. So I'm using child abuse now. Well, the, the specifically, yes. 
I did. I felt bad doing the shack because it was an A OK, so I had to take it out. There's the cane and the tooth and claw. Those are my yeah. really shitty. Those are shitty comics. Awful. All right, all right, let's see Allen's again. Uh, okay, uh, so we got like just a cover. Yeah. We got somebody's <laughs> hungry and they ate a Matt Baker. Uh, we got Future Shock with amazingly bad artwork. Mm -hmm. And speaking of bad artwork, we got the king of bad artwork. Liefeld. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and then not we even, have not his worst cover though. Not his worst cover though. No, I, yeah, that's true. It's but it's very nice. I think I think Alan had the most most the bit the worst one of all. That was the worst one of the brigade. Alan had the one brigade. worst one of all, but Which was the over the overall. You want to show him again, lady? You can. Oh. Uh <laughs> Mine. Did, did to I be have fair. Pain from this from this round. Tech world. Tech world's trash. Men in black. Trash. That's correct. <laughs> X Men annual. Super. That trash. one I like. I like that one. I actually like that one. <laughs> I see, see Scooby doing it. Avengers. Trash. Okay. Fair enough. All right, we're gonna put the vote in. Good luck to everybody. And your trash. My, my vote goes. My vote goes to Lady F. <laughs> Thank you for my. Okay. Thank you. My vote is going That's to two. Alan. That's oh, two for Alan. Oh wow. Alan, you had two of the most horrible. I almost, I almost showed the pact as well. That's another. That one. would have been a great one, Alan. That would have been better than whatever your last one was. <laughs> oh, no, you the last one. I just showed it because. Hello no for Alan. <laughs> it was a joke that I showed that other one. But, um, well, my, my cover is actually beating a child. How can I lose? Oh, <laughs> verbally, <laughs> verbally abusing a child. No, they beat the hell out of it. What do you mean? They just verbal. There's one where she hold on. That's no, they're awesome. verbal. It's verbal. Oh, look, she's got her by the hair. She's got no, her by the like, wrist. She's like, no, she's got her by the wrist. She's not assaulting her. She's just telling her how much she hates her for. She's got her fist. Oh, okay. Maybe she ain't like hitting she's her. She's gonna pound her on the back of the head. Yeah, yeah. This will for be real. Have you ever had a drunk stepdad cuss you out before? I mean, come on, look at that. <laughs> well, well, I mean, I feel like the I feel like the physical abuse is coming after that verbal abuse because the the alcohol is there. I mean, the whole darkness is present. I literally and, have a seventies rockers coke dream happening over here. You think this reads well? <laughs> that's pretty bad. That's like an ET hand that, too. Like, no, what the fuck is the cool. hand about? Joe, for technical points, you definitely tied Alan, but Alan had two of the worst covers from this round, so I had to I had to lean into him. Well, as of right now, uh, Lady F and Alan's tied, so so they each have two points. That yeah, yeah. Beautiful interior art, though it's it's pretty awesome. Lady F got me on that X Men annual. No, I've it's always, awful. I, I've always, <laughs> it's like really. It's really it makes bad. me angry every yeah. time I see it. It's like, why? Why did they do that? And they even have a movie. <laughs> There's some interior too. Hold on. Oh. Horrifying. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Hold oh, on. <laughs> he wants to show his interior too. Everybody's wanting to prove how shitty their book is. I, I know. That bring... <laughs> I have a box of just my crappiest comics. So. That looks like Jack Nicholas. I have a couple of boxes like no, that. That art, man. That art isn't that bad. Sorry, shit, dude. Is your lens clean? Holy crap! Look, I see a lot worse. Actually, that's not bad. That's not bad. It's visually not bad. It's I'm not. sure it reads terrible, but the artwork is not terrible. It's not terrible. Yeah, the artwork not is terrible. Pretty, the artwork is pretty standard. It's not. It's yeah. not. Uh, the ones that I hate, which would be uh, uh, what's it called, Le 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 Lefeld, uh, that he's strike one, Jared Le Jared is strike two. Um, so who won the first like, oh, first battle? Right. And if it and if it's Magnola outside of Hellboy, I might also reduce points. Who won the first Pokan? No, no the first one's Lydia. The second one's Alan. Oh no! I'm saying the first, the first fight. Oh, Lady F won. Yeah. yeah. Yes. And right oh, now, man. as it stands in the chat, uh, you have a vote from Rad. So this is the issue I'm talking about, where okay. Mr. Sanders. It's a uh, well, X Factor Inferno. Yeah, look how gnarly Storm looks. She's got what like. What number is naked. that, buddy? 
uh, X Factor 39, and I'll show he you the panel hot, I'm talking yeah. about. Um, so, right here. She, I got some she, X, uh, X Factors around that. Do you have the X Factor 41? Uh, I don't know. I might. You see right here, he's like kissing Jean, right? He grabs her. Mm -hmm. and he, he's i think he smooches on her yeah he does he definitely smooches on her and then uh beast grabs gene and he's like gene come on looks like in about a second the last place you'll want to be and then he don't finish but he he just fucking blows him into smithereens like wow that's a hell of a panel right there man i was like okay who is it that he blows up though mr sister Oh shit! Yeah, yeah. Is he dead, or is that just some imagination shit? I don't know if that's canon or not. Well, he can he can regenerate. He can regenerate, so it don't fucking matter, right? Yeah, exactly. Okay. I'm pretty sure he could have exploded, and that would have been that. Wolverine looks stupid as fuck through this whole thing. He had like that. Who's the artist, Biggie? I think well, it's Art Adams. Really? So really? I would guess. You see how Wolverine has like blotchy ass mask shit going on? Dude, yeah, big ass. Ass. What? It, this issue is Walt Simonson. Oh, it's White Simon. Okay. Yeah. I was just guessing Art Adams. Look, look at the front. Look at the beginning where it tells you. Oh, yeah. um, In the first I can't book. read the signature, but if you open it up, yeah, it probably says, oh, Louis Simonson, Walter Simonson, yeah. Alan Milgram, Inker. Pretty sweet. So yes. nobody else is going to vote. I guess it's going to tie. There's nine people in here. They must just be lurking. So nobody voted in the chat line. We got one vote for me, and it's just Norrin Rad talking right now. We got nine people in chat, but nobody. They must all be busy eating something. I guess I don't know. Give us a vote for Lady F or uh, Alan, and we can wrap the round up. I don't have to go to. I, I we might just move on. So. Take a minute, huh? It's ugly, right? This was ugly. Uh, Alan, Lady F. Okay, so <laughs> Alan wins. Oh, I won this round. Yeah, I want to see a one-on-one -on -one, though. If if y'all don't care, bro, she just gave it to you, Alan, bro. What do you mean you won this round? Oh, Vinny, Vinny <laughs> picked he, Alan. She voted for me. Oh no. I was just gonna roll with it because it made to help the, the show go, but Ben. Oh, yeah, I could I could vote for her then. That mess everything. Well, no, oh. Ben Compton voted for you, so you actually did win. Okay. Oh, you won. Okay. okay. All right. So it's up to y'all if you want to do this or not, but I think the two winners should be the last battle. Oh, I don't want to go against Alan. He's gonna beat my ass. Agree. I don't know. I feel like I should choose the topic. Choose the topic. Okay. Golden Age, good girl. Um, became well, all you're doing is naming what I don't want to give you. <laughs> um, wait, 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 wait. Hold on, I'm, I'm almost there. I'm almost okay. there. Try to think of something evenly where both of them could. Have How do you thrive? feel about anniversary covers? No. I don't feel okay. like that. <laughs> I don't know really yeah. about that either. I don't even know what ones would. It would be like you could do like issue one hundred, issue two hundred, yeah, or... centennials. Um, yeah, yeah. For, forty-five years of so and so. Like that's what I had in mind. But that one's that one's a big ask. Yeah, um, it's like finding those is the problem. <laughs> it's like, all right, how about villain covers? Okay, I can live with. Villain. I was thinking like boyfriend girlfriend. But that's too easy for Alan, probably, right? That's more. That's it's more way too me. easy for Alan. I just saw him do like seventy romance covers. I just, Alan. I just saw a stupid X Men <laughs> cover. Maybe think of it. Box I could just grab from. Let's yeah, yeah, you're villain. right. All right, villains. 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 All right, give me villains? a minute. Let me go get stuff. All right, I'll get villains too. I think that's fair. Yeah. I hope I see uh, uh, a one of my favorite Lady F books. She, she might show it. While they go, while they go look for twirling mustaches, Joe, how have you been? Been good. Been doing pretty good. Easter's gonna be fun, dude. Y'all, y'all, I'm gonna show y'all where I got book for Easter. You got a book? I'll go Easter. get it. Yeah, this is such a badass Neil Adams cover, man. Oh my god! Wow, that is great. Oh that's my a, god! That's a good one. The interior art is really good as well. Oh, you read it? Ooh. 
That's do I so dare, cool. dude? Years dude. ago, interior. But check out the dude. Open it up and look at the interior art, bro. It's really good. You know what's so cool about this book, Hylia? You don't, do you? Well, tell me. Okay. When I went to C two E two, and whenever oh. I dug in the long boxes looking at books. This is the book I saw while I was with Comic Head eighty four. Oh, nice! And he and he bought it for me. Nice, that's a great. Yeah, so, yeah. Open it's, it it's up. So cool. Art is. I might. Art, I might have to open it up. The art and the story is really good. I'm gonna go get the rocks I got, but y'all continue on without me. I'll be right back. Good job. You worked on. Uh, worked on anything fancy lately? You know, in the armory. Whoa. Damn, it's heavy. I haven't seen the one that you got. I'm about to finish, babe. Yeah. I can't hear you. Can't hear you. Oh, y'all can hear me. No, I can hear you, Biggie. I can't hear Joe. It's a oh, did I mute him? I'm so sorry, Pokey. If I muted you, let me see. Here we go. Can you hear me now? Yeah. Yeah, we hear you. Are you already working on the armory? Man. They were just asking me a question. <laughs> uh, I just made a. I, I just posted an evil layer video today. Oh, oh good. Yeah, the Cali Comics reached out to me and asked me to make a. Um, he sent me a comic book and asked me to make a ring out of the comic. Yes. Book. So I, uh, I, 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 I did the the send. I burned a comic book down to its carbon, made it into rubies, and then we uh, forged a ring out. Of it. It's Lay fucking it beautiful. It's oh probably the coolest. You know, that gives me such a great idea. I should send you copies of North Star's wedding if I ever fucking find someone to marry me. Yeah. It, it, the, no, but no shit, guys. Out of all the things Pokans made, I saw this before it got to the person who got it. This is my favorite thing Pokans made because they're like made from comic books and they're real gemstones inside. It's so fucking cool. So oh. I got little Shack, a uh, cute uh, rabbit. Dude, y'all are going to love these rocks. All right. So this is just um, Agus. And it was like five bucks. Agus? Oh, this ain't the Agus. I don't know what the hell. This must have been free. I don't know what the hell that is. You never heard of Agus? Agus. 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 It's a stone. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, this was like $5. It was a pretty good price for a big-ass rocket. Got some good collar in it. Oh, I know what this is. This is a fucking geode. So you got a crack in there's Christmas in it. Okay. Um, no, I know. I realized that once you start yelling, you start yelling, I was like, oh, another geode. We got like 20 of these things. No, this is an egg. I don't know what the fuck this is. Melody got the egg. It was like 20 bucks. That's a fabric egg. Get out, bub. You can't see. No, no. You got to shut the door. Get out of here. Yeah, I know you want to see it. <laughs> All right. That's the coolest one. You really can't see this one. This is probably going to be his best rock now. Uh, it was on sale. Usually things are like 50, 60 bucks, dude, but look at that. Oh, that was like those. Nice. Like a geode. Yeah, like only 20 bucks. Is it? Right. I'm sorry. Is that start as a white and then moves into a blue in the center? Uh yeah, yeah, yeah. It's Corbett. That's actually a crystal. It's not really a stone. That's cool. Yeah, it's really. Sm I like it when they're really tiny like that. Like I, yeah. I have them, but they're bigger. That's pretty cool. D it, is your kid like into rocks? Is that his? Oh, thing? dude, I got like a Rubbermaid bin. We've been. I'll get him like a three, five dollar rock every day and. He's probably got like two hundred. He's probably got like five hundred dollars worth of rocks, really. That's really cool. Yeah, I like that kind of stuff too. That's pretty cool. I thought I had missed something on Easter. I didn't remember rocks as something that had to. Be I mean, but now I cool. get. No, I get it. He's into it. That's fine. I, I was just associating with Easter, and I was like, "Wow, I've never heard of rocks when Easter." That's all I. Remember. Oh yeah, yeah. Well, it's one of those things where. It's like he has a lot of toys, and I, I collect toys. And uh, if he gets a toy, it'll just be trash within a week. At least with the rocks, they kind of stick around. Yeah, it gives him something to throw at people he don't like. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It gives him ammunition. <laughs> <laughs> at Easter. <laughs> Wait until he gets into slingshot. You know what? You need to give him a slingshot. 
That's what he needs, bro. That's what he needs for Easter. Oh, uh, you didn't see the beginning of the episode. I had a bunch of Nerf guns he has. Uh, yeah, he's getting into weapons. Yeah, yeah it's real good because he likes to shoot TVs and stuff. So, How old is your uh, son? He's six. Cool. Yeah. All right, so we got villains. You guys ready to rock last round? Lady F? All right, sweet. Do what up, Lucha? Or do you want me to go first? What's up, Nathy? I feel like Lady F's playing coy. Let's see if she'll go. No, God damn it! Give me a second. My comics are on the other end of the thing. Okay, oh, let, let I'll, I'll go first. I think, I think I'll give her a minute. Let's go, Rosanna. Let's go, Rosanna. Okay, so we're gonna go with this first one, with sort of like a Sandman-like guy coming through the window. Yeah. Kind of a. And then she's going for like the gun. She's in her oh, that issue. That's issue seven. Yeah, this is uh, down with crime number seven. Yeah. And villains. Yeah. With villains. That's the first one. And this one I really like. This is uh, the hooded menace. And they're not. Oh. They're not the KKK. There. There was actually a real group of people that uh, were terrorizing everybody. It was All like right, the, I'm coming. I'm coming. God damn it. This hooded guy. I don't think my shit is easily extended. We have some crime suspense stories. This guy looks like a maniac mm. with a razor blade. That's and you can see just the hands of the guy. Yeah, switch this blade. A, and this is a Johnny Craig cover. It's like a switch. Well, it's like it looks like a like um like one of those um razor, you know, like a shaving. Yeah. Nice, right? Mm. Straight razor, then, yeah. Yeah. Razor. And then this one's a really great one with two thugs and they're like torturing the girl. Mm -hmm. And you got the guy in the background. He's all her, maybe her boyfriend or something. He's all tied up and she's all tied up. This is underwear. I, 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 lo I love the uh, sexual undertone of your covers. Like, this one screams cuckold action. Like, I just love <laughs> A bit of cuckold action. <laughs> so, yeah, so and the, the guys are, it's just amazing artwork on that. And then we got the last one. This is my favorite. This is kind of the craziest, one of the craziest Golden Age covers with a villain on the cover is this woman. She's in bondage, and you got this little guy with a syringe poking it right into her neck. Damn, that's Jeez. Awesome. Isn't that that's awesome? Dick Tracy coming in through I mean, the door. It's, it's awesome for her. Is that Dick Tracy or is it just a Dick Tracy knockoff? It's called Manhunt. It's not Dick Tracy. <laughs> it's a different Dude, character. That is a wicked cover. Oh. Isn't that awesome? Yeah. All right, so those are mine. Those okay. Are my mine. I'm not mad at that. Hylia likes rocks, but not right. that kind. Oh. <laughs> Burn. All right. Uh, Got that pimp daddy kingpin just uh, doing the man spread in the corner because he knows he's got it. That's a, he knows good, one. What's up. That's a good one. Yeah, Esad Ribic, uh, great art. Um, then we got our galactic gangster Thanos. Nice. Um, classic. He don't play. Um, and in that same light, we got another galactic gangster uh, galactic oh. Like this. Alter yeah. cover, very nice. Big Daddy. Yeah. And then um, I've always loved this, uh, and this is a really good. This is a hell of a villain. Thank you, George Perez. Yeah. Oh, Taskmaster. Yes. Yeah. Nice. One ninety-six. A good villain, and I think this is the one that uh, Mr. Biggie was expecting. Uh, Fourteen. The First Sentinels. Appearance. Of the Sentinels. That is That's such point. a good cover, man. I didn't appreciate that cover until I actually got a copy and it was like, oh, yeah, damn. Really cool. Yeah. I appreciate that so, cover. These are all my villains Sentinel, Taskmaster, Thanos, Kingpin, and my boy, Galactus. Nice. Well done, Lady F. That little extra five seconds really helped, Lady F. Uh, is it, somebody's mic's humming a little bit. Anybody notice that? Here, was that me? 
Uh, it wasn't Alan. It's not Lady F. Not you, is it me? Oh. oh. Joe? I think it might be Pocan. Yeah. There it went. <laughs> it's out. Okay. All right. Homing, you have like right. a home about you. Is it because Pokan is it's a cyborg and like we're, we're just keeping quiet about it? Probably. <laughs> I don't know. I'm still there. <laughs> I think you're covered by Homer. Alzheimer's for Lady F. I'm going Lady F. And, and plus, I like to see Alan lose. So I'm going oh, Lady Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I'll keep that in mind in future. Uh... Oh. Hey, all right. <laughs> All right. This is supposed to be a fair democratic process. Those are her. Those are many have so classic villains that I love. Yeah, yeah, no, they're all. I really appreciate ones. that Lady F brought the classic villains, and her two best books for me were the Ec was the Sentinels and Taskmaster. However, Alan whipped out covers that would truly give me nightmares, such as the Hooded Menace, the Crime of the Stories, and also Manhunt with the little dude injecting the girl. Um, so by point two points, I gave this one to Alan. Oh. Yeah, I'm going to go with Alan on this one, too. As much as I love the covers at Lady Fan, she really brought it, no doubt. Yeah, absolutely. Get away from her. Yes. But pre-code horror hypodermic needle. That, yeah, yeah. that, yeah. that, yeah. that, yeah. that, that really was. That really was. Yeah. <laughs> it's such a crazy cover. It's like one of the craziest yeah. Golden That's Age cool. covers. Yeah. And I have to be somewhat biased. I, I collect Golden Age and, and early Silver Age myself. So yeah, I'm kind of I'm kind of drawn to that. But again, showing recognizable covers is also important as well. But mm -hmm. yeah, I'm, I'm going by the things that I wanted. Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> and, I love right. me, and I love me I love me that Thanos cover too. I have like who did <laughs> who did um Hylia pick? He Lady chose F. Lady F, but he did it spitefully. No. <laughs> Lady F, He's Lady a F, a F. Alan. That was, that was just an added little, you know. Oh, the added, you mean you meant to Oh, Cliff picked Alan, Alan too? Yeah. Cliff yeah. picked Alan. Highly yeah. picked Alan. Okay. I agree. I, I like Lady F's better. That's more my thing. Pocan and Cliff like picked Hylia. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Pocan and Alan. He picked <laughs> Alan. Pocan and Riley have picked Alan. I don't know. I'm sorry. Great villain covers, Lady F. Benny Compton picked Lady F or Alan. I'll vote for Alan too. No, don't vote. Oh, for Bleaker me. made it. You can't it. vote for me. You can't vote for me. If you vote for me, I vote for you. Oh, oh he looks shit. like Sting. Oh, well, Bleaker made it fresh. Somebody's in a mood. <laughs> hey, is the hunt tonight, oh, Bleak? Wow. A little bit of a hissy. Nah, not, they were doing a uh, they were doing a pro in depth retrospective. Oh, okay. oh you're on Mon That's comics. Cool. Yeah. Wow. Sweet. You should have played the crow. You're not wrong, brother. You're not wrong. That would have been cool. It <laughs> would have been a better cast, to be honest. Fuck. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Seriously. You have the right look for it. You know, I I would ask to look at the books again because it would just make it it would just make it more painful for voting against one of y'all because I'd make y'all do all that to just vote against one of you. So I'm gonna go with my gut. <laughs> Fucking vote for people. <laughs> so I gotta I gotta admit, man, I love Lady F's shit because she picked the right characters, but there was just more dastardly shit going on on fucking Alan. So I'm gonna go with Alan. If, if the if the villains that Lady F picked were like fucking people up like Alan's was, it'd been easy pick. The thing is, like it's, it's super iconic villains versus iconically horrific villainy. Like that yeah, like the shit Alan's villain. shit was actually doing stuff. That was bad. So I, I think that's a little bit more up for me. Surrealism. Like they, they look like things that could happen. It's not <laughs> all Look at him. He's just, he's just, it's, that's not yeah, let's, kind of, let's, let's soak in the, the bleaker. Oh, looking pretty cool. These things will kill you. <laughs> Say no to makeup. 
Uh, all right. That's awesome. Lady F, you battled valiantly, and that was a hell of a round, dude. I tried like, my dandest, shoot. but uh, you did very Good well. Uh, congrats, Alan. Congrats, yep. oh, thank Alan. you. Thank you. I That's back to back, bro. Yeah, show some Alan books. Let's get that in. I almost showed this extra one. This is a good Eerie. lord. What 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 kind of monster is that even supposed to be? Uh it says monster of the storm. I have no idea what that means. Don't even have have so this, no, one those, this is one of those like creatures that can only emerge on a dark, murky, stormy night. Almost looks like some kind of like marijuana monster. Look at this. Hey. You know, it's got like the, the flowers and stuff going on. <laughs> it almost looks like a, it's kind of it sounds like some propaganda forties nonsense, is what it sounds yeah, like. Yeah, maybe marijuana not monsters. <laughs> And then, oh, what else do I got here? I got, I, I had my all my good girl stuff going around. Okay, so. You're you're fired. They, like they're all like expecting their dad to get a raise, and he gets. Yeah, Alan did his ten to twenty top fifty today, and all of them were bigger than any of my books. So that was fun to watch. <laughs> yeah, well, that's fair. Mine too, for sure. So, yeah, so the, this is um, everything happens to Harvey number one. And it's a pedigree as well. This is actually pedigree a pro. Of, um, so this is the drone wanker. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> oh, That's but, a good one. You got a wanker cover. Okay. <laughs> yeah, you know what's funny about it though? Um, the guy actually he had almost a complete collection of DC comics up till the 90s. He was only missing 24 issues of everything ever that DC produced. And that's this is from his collection. You got wow. a true wanker there. Yeah, that's a true anchor. And then we got some gay stuff. <laughs> <laughs> gay comedy. If only yeah. were as gay as it needed to be. Yeah. I remember when Alan did that what, uh, early club <laughs> episode. It was all gay comics. You said, I'm just going to show gay comics the whole show. <laughs> <laughs> and then we got some more gay. Actually, I almost wow. showed this like for the. Like if we did good, bad, and the ugly, it would have been like the girl is good. And then the little, little, the guy, the little crabby guy right here that's biting your toe is the bad and the ugly is the fact that the guy's going to drown in the background well he's got some funky shoes on too i don't know what's going on with his shoes there yeah why is he wearing yeah, you're right he's got some it's the sandals they're terrible yeah, and a little gay sandals. Sandals. those are the gayest shoes i ever seen in my life <laughs> actually his proportions are really like he missed leg there or something his legs are really some good. sexy legs for a man too like what the fuck? yeah what those legs Weird. Weird. I love the fact that y'all say that you didn't notice he was wearing grandma panties the entire time in that cover. Yeah, well, he's wearing like yeah. Superman kind of shorts or something. And Millie's yeah. my girl. That's my Millie favorite Golden Age. Yeah, hey, that's what cool. What number is that one, Alan? This is number two. Uh, it's actually kind of an interesting book because it's the first uh, like prototype appearance of Blonde Phantom. No shit. Yeah, it's kind of got cool. such cool stuff, my man. And then we got some Green Llama. Number oh, one. wow. A lot of Green Llama, yes. Bang I'm trying to get the complete run. I'm only missing a couple issues now. How many issues? What are they, like nine? Nine. Yeah, you you know. Oh, yeah. I, may, I may know. <laughs> well, you're right. <laughs> and then oh, wow, over. that's great. This Classic. looks like an Archie book, but it's actually uh, Tower Comics. Did that come out after or before Bewitched? Ah, before. before that's way before Bewitched. Oh, oh, did she like come out oh yeah, Sabrina. <laughs> yeah, that iconic cover. You know, is this it before looks like after? Sabrina? Yeah, you're. That's beautiful. Yeah, it's, I thought it was cool. And then we got some Patsy Walker. Hey, girl. Ah. Uh... Big guy dancing with little girl and little the, the guy dancing easy, with big girl. The easy days of Patsy Walker. Yeah, just yeah. doing her best to be a socialite before coming a receptionist, before going by the cats, then becoming <laughs> cow cats. <laughs> no, the huge. Yeah. I'm going to show you a couple of Tessie as well. Tessie the typist. Oh, that's mm. interesting. I've really? never heard of Tessie the typist. This one. Yeah, so Marvel had like a whole bunch of these like Millie the model, Tessie the typist, Nellie the nurse. She's working right. so hard, and that dude's just a lazy asshole. Look at him. I know he's like not even doing anything. Free but my, what a but my favorite is this one. Oh, you know, she's bad. all the fish are in love with her, so they jump into her net. Oh. Not very cute. 
She can wear those waiters. She can wear those waiters anytime. <laughs> exactly. And this is, uh, these are all uh, Weiss covers. <laughs> So that's it. That's it for now. Did the, uh, who did the first Deadshot cover? Anybody familiar? First Deadshot? Headshot. Yeah, you just got you got a first Deadshot Batman recently, oh, didn't you? I thought you said headshot. Oh, Deadshot. Yeah. Um. Actually, I did not wait. I have to. I it ain't Sprain. It's not Dick Sprain. No, it was somebody else. It was like, oh, that's really cool that it's that person. Um, you got this one, Alan. Brave and the Bold. Frame Bowl 200? Yes. Yeah, oh, I figured you might. I'm just going to show a couple. First Katana. Yeah. Love this that. might be a good, good, and bad, and ugly. I don't know who it would be. That would be bad. a good villain one, big. No, yeah, a good villain one. Yeah, that'd be good a good idea. villain one, yeah. And the last book I'll show tonight is the 181. Oh. Bang, bang. <laughs> Congratulations. Good, bad, and ugly. Yeah, that's a beauty, big. I'm. That actually is a good, bad, and ugly one. You know, you got all it, really it could is. work. Yeah, you'd have to say Wolverine's bad, or uh, Wolverine's bad, because Wolverine was sent to kill the, the X Men, wasn't he? He's a bad guy in that. Well, yeah. I was on Cliff's trivia show, and he said, "What Canadian superhero was started off a bad guy that meant to kill Professor X?" I think, and it was fucking Wolverine. Wow. Yep. You remember that? So in the expanded origin, because you know as the years go on and people tell more stories and add, right? The first time Wolverine encounters Professor Xavier, Xavier gets right in his mind, convinces him not to kill him, and then programs him that the next time they meet, he will join the X-Men. Yeah. Wow. Right. I remember that right. story. Like, yeah. You guys want to see something cool, though? Yeah, no, Alan, yeah. Alan will appreciate yeah. this. So this is... Pep Comics number 17. Oh, wow. wow. First death of a superhero in comic books and the origin of um, Hangman. Wow. Who did they kill in that book? Uh, Comet. It was the first. He was gunned down in an alley. Wow. Oh, no. That's crazy. Yeah, it's, uh, that definitely goes to the one. Uh, some stuff that I just picked up for funsies. I just dig this cover. It's not a key. Hell idea. yeah. It's really pretty, man. <laughs> It's well, just an insane cover. It's a key yeah. just for being a crazy ass it's, cover. Yeah. It's in my collection, therefore it is a key now. <laughs> <laughs> That's how it works. Oh, Captain Action. Captain Action. I love. I love this comic book series. I'm sorry. I know it's not very popular. Out oh, there, I love that Panther. Yeah, that's the. Yeah. Rawr. <laughs> yeah, it's too. Like he was designed by a toy company, right? Yeah. Uh, my weird horror stuff that I like to collect kind of just out oh, there. fun, fun. That's number is that number one? Yeah, I have a few from that series. Yeah, that's cool. Great series. I've all but finished my comic book 80s collection. I recently got this as an AOK. -okay. Thanks, mm. thank you. Nice. 80s collection. <laughs> nice. I've been to two comic cons and 17 comic book shops to find this, and I cannot find it for the 80s. I comic. think it's I remember you talking fun. about that. Yeah, you said it's so hard to find a George number one. I remember. Crazy. It is it's really hard crazy. to find. Yeah. Crazy good. Count Dracula. Oh, I got that bad boy. Love this one. Oh, wow. So Fuck, is that number one? Yeah. Uh, well, the Fuck. reprint. Well, yeah, no, no. This is the original. This is their first Silver Age appearance. Is really, yeah. they've appeared in other stuff. They yeah. appeared different. Yeah, yeah. Golden age. I have, yeah. I have the golden age. Very well centered too. That looks nice. Which I have that one too. That's Isn't weird. That weird. <laughs> uh, oh, tell me that's not Popeye. It's it, 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 it yeah. is. Yeah. What's his yeah. name though? Oh. I forget. Dude, that's a that's a that's a good key. It's um, actually Captain Strong. Popeye. Yeah, that's right, Captain Strong. But tell me it's not Captain Popeye. Oh, no, he's Popeye. absolutely designed to be a, a Popeye knockoff. <laughs> yeah. He even has the anchor on his arm. Yeah. Grab pick that up just for fun. Oh, my God. Nice. You jerk. Damn, that's a legit one? Fuck, that's nasty. Pick that up for funsies. I got one of these. Um. Yep. No, don't have that either. I mean, I do have the Batman. Another but... stupid hard one to find for the 80s collection. Love First appearance of Mad Balls in comic books. Oh, wow. What number Care Bear is that? This is number 13. 
Interesting. Oh, well, lucky thirteen too. That's stupid, right? I just, Why I is that the first ball. Care Bears? Is number thirteen? No, it's no, 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 no. Mad Balls. Mad Balls. Mad Balls. Yeah, from the eighties. Oh. Yeah. I'll have to look for that it's one because That's a cool. lot of that stuff didn't have high run counts. I don't. Yeah. Know. There's just some recent pickups from Kansas uh, from Planet Con. Oh I yeah. A, I got a couple really cool. books I can show big. Show us nothing crazy, nothing crazy, nothing like that. But I got space worms. Yeah. Oh, wow. K pop. I know that book. That is a fun book to read. By Mr. Kevin Strange. I got Ultimate Black Panther. Oh, oh you dirty dog. I thought you didn't get new books. Look at you. Yeah. I've been ordered. I I have a Facebook group that I order books through the year and then the guy just ships them to me eventually. Oh, huh. cool. That's Ultimate oh. Spider Man number one. Nice. Yeah, Ultimate Spider Man number one. This is a. Oh, fuck. Book. I don't even have that, man. I, I pull new books. And I don't get those fucking books. And then, wow, yeah. awesome. Yeah, they, 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 That's sometimes, gnarly. sometimes I order shit and they just don't get it for me. It's so fucked up. Uh, I got this. Is awesome. Little kiss zombie action. Oh, oh sweet. But you gotta have kiss zombies. I got this because I'm gonna do a piece of art on it. So it's like deceased dead planet, but it looks cool. The uh, cover of it. Yeah, looks it, cool. it looks yeah, kind of tattered looking. So I'll do some art on that. I got this guy. This actually. Looks cool. oh. Yeah, fucking lady after show. That cover is a winner. No, it's like yeah. slightly different than the one she yeah, showed. Oh, the is it? In the mine, mine is second yeah, print. Second print has the space. Mine's very negative. Oh, fuck. That's the same thing. Okay. Just and different. then we got some Frank Frazetta Death Dealer. Oh, wow. Nice. Right. Nice. And this is like the ultimate 90s fucking cover of all time, so I had to get it. Oh, Whoa. Wow. Just the foiliest of foiliest green. Awesome. When did that come out, bro? Uh, this is the Joker uh, who stopped laughing, so I'm guessing 2022. Oh, I think around then, but this wow. was a variant cover for it that I didn't get. So, and then I got that guy. Oh, nice. Damn, I like the negative space Love ones. That. Yeah, this is a really cool negative space one. I don't, I don't buy a lot of the negative space covers, but the ones I, you know, there are some very cool ones. We got uh, the Ultimate Thor number one, oh, which cool. doesn't look like Thor. We're still on. We're still debating on who's on the front cover there. Uh, Spider Man, End of the Spider Verse. Uh, this is the first uh, Spider Verse. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So I had to get that. It's not the cover that everybody wants, but it was a lot cheaper than that cover. <laughs> Actually, you know what's funny? I prefer that cover. And then Fuck this, yeah, Bleak. I got this for three fucking dollars, and it's a mint copy of Truth Number One. It's like a two hundred dollar wow. book, man. Yeah, yeah. You know what? The, I have no idea why that book is currently not on the radar. It makes that no series is great, me, bro. Makes no sense. I was like, oh yeah, I'm buying that. This is a I don't even know what the cheapest one would be, like thirty or forty dollars, maybe. I don't know. I got if it's like low grade. Where did that's you that, find yeah. that's my, you yeah. find? that's my stack of comics? I have to I have to look that up. I don't know what the price is on that right now. Where did you get that bleak? Uh oh, so I'm on a dead. Facebook uh, group like uh you know, like comic Facebook stuff. Nice. And I don't go on Facebook very much, but uh, every now and again, my comic stuff will ring. And a dude uh, from Canada, he sells comics on there. And where I do just, you want? I just buy off his auctions. Um, wherever nice. you want to put it. Yeah, put it um, maybe under. I don't know wherever you want. Maybe across. We're same direction as Bleaker. Oh, same direction as Bleaker. Oh, like, like above it. That, above it, yeah. Do it above it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> all right so i sold all of my uh frazetta creepies but i kept my favorite one and it's this one nice what yeah. number is that it's number 10 it's the first frank bruner art it's uh he's like oh. a one of those melon artist guys on here i think i'm not sure if you knew this but they actually made a poster of that Oh, dude, this is one of the most nostalgic, creepy covers there are. Oh, yeah, they have a lot of shit of this. There's keychains, all types of shit. No, but I mean, the actual Warren company made a poster of it. Like, a, I have the poster. Oh, well, that'd be cool. I'd like to have that, too. Um, I, like I think I've seen it on, like, the Omnis and shit. The real thick one, okay. Yeah, um, yeah I, didn't, I didn't keep much. I kept this shit. I don't know what it is, but... What is it, number one, Savage Sword of Conan? You never yeah, know. 
You never know. I kept my turtles. I didn't have to sell them, so that's good. Uh, I was good. thinking about it. Good deal. I never yeah. wanted to get rid of that boat. That's a good one. Yeah. I got a third print or whatever. And then I got that one still. And oh, the awesome. damn, and this is one. I got one. that one because of you. <laughs> oh, yeah. I think Bleak, Bleaker has one now. All of us are getting it. Um, What's that? Sorry. This one. The previous one. It's the first turtles. Oh, yeah, yeah. I got one of those. Yep. This is badass, man. Y'all need to get this next. What Nexus? This is the very first Nexus. This is Steve Rude and Rick Rude Ravishing. It's good art, actually. I like the cover. Yeah. It's a good read, too. And what is this, this is a Nexus one? It's just Nexus one. Yeah, yeah. Um, if you can get the other ones, they're good too. But I got a really high grade copy at the Ohio State Fair. It was only I, I bought like two books. I bought this one for twenty bucks or fifteen dollars or something. Not bad. So, yeah. Right. We had a good uh, club, you know. Um, I appreciate the chat activity and. I got, uh, like four books I want to show. Yeah, show us some stuff before we roll out. Oh, okay. I got five, but... I picked up one, this one today, um, at my LCS, uh, 165. Nice. There's a little something in the corner. A oh, little signature the fuck there. Who's that? Who's that Who's one? signature is that? Todd McFarlane? A little Jim Stranky. Oh. Stranky. Damn, that's a beautiful sig. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, not used to, I'm not used to seeing Stranko sigs. Hmm. Yeah. Glenn Stranko signature. Found that baby. Very excited. Um, I picked this up recently. It's a JFK. Um, Damn. That book. That shit's yeah. hard as fuck. Yeah, I thought that was really cool. Um, I also picked up this American Airlines like complimentary. Uh, oh, yeah. That Harvey made a bad AFK joke because that was. A I love shot. promotional comic books. Those are that is a bad. fucking badass promo comic. I'm just sucker for them. And then I also found this really cool tin center. Um, this uh, it's oh, just strange strange and... dispenser. They're, they're fucking loaded over there, Alan. Fucking ladies, fucking shops are phenomenal in Tennessee. I I am super jelly. The artwork on the blonde is really good. Oh man, that's beautiful. Yeah, that's really cool. That must be one of the last issues in the series because um, it was a pre-code uh, series. Issue four. How much was that? It's probably uh, like it, five, ten bucks or something, huh? That was eleven. It was eleven. Yeah. Bucks. yeah. Oh, wow. Um, Ghost of Doctor Graves. Oh shit! Is that Dicko? Uh, I don't know. Damn, I know that they do, he does them Charlton ghosts. No, it's not. Whatever. It's a uh, Tom Sutton. It looks like. That's fucking. Um, and pretty. then that's it. That's all. Oh well, well. Anybody else got any more books? I you got do. some, Cliff? All right. All right. Not to be left out, some Ultimate Black Panther. Nice, nice. Oh, nice. 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 Hold on, let me put Storm away preciously. All right, Thor 131. Oh, great one. Very cool. It's, it's such a great cover. All right, we're done. Oh, hold on. Guys. Thor 247, just because I like me some Fire Lord. Love it. Got one. Yeah. Yes, sir. Love your taste. And then just because it's a great cover, I just, I don't know. I just love the cover, but Thor 249. Don't have that one. That, there's yes. a one on there, but it looks good. It looks yeah. good, right? Yeah. Right, yeah. So we, got some Captain, we got some Captain Americas. Loves it. Oh, I, I like it. It's such a strong classic cover. I love Who it. Who drew that one? That's a good cover. I, I don't know. I'm going to have to find out, but it's a great cover. Okay. This one's a lot of just fun cover. Yes. Yeah. Oh, wow. Nice. And another fun cap cover. One number two sixteen. Ah, 216. very cool. With the human torch. Mm -hmm. And then this cover, just because I'm just amused by it, and it's an early Marvel team up. Yeah. Oh, that's cool, man. I love that. It's like he's like he's like yeah, I'll knock out mole men while hanging from from Mister Fantastic. Practical enough. And then this oh, cover is very good, good, bad, and ugly. Namor three nine with Modok. <laughs> 
Love it. And of course, Lady Fantastic so also saw this one earlier, but it's a Mariner number 50. Yes. Oh, that's, nice. a really good one. that's the first appearance of Maria. Yeah, yeah Nimaria. Yeah. Maria, Maria. I, I need that one. Yeah, I just that was a very that was a very that was a very wild evening of me on whatnot. And, I bet uh, it. <laughs> you must be going in. Let me see that fifty before I was out the door. And Marita, that's not a cheap. Oh, I mean, I did get a good deal on it, but I think I regret how much I spent that evening. <laughs> What'd you spend? I, I don't remember. I know it was a pain. Oh, you remember. Stop lying. You, you remember. Drinking? You remember. <laughs> Were you drinking? No, I don't remember that specific. I know the grand total. I, I hate cool. myself. I know that. Thanks, B. Nice. Right above you, Bleak. No problem, man. There's a new champ. I got to get my name on here again. My last one was right down there, Biggie Shack. All right. Well. Had a pretty good turnout. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. Showed up. Uh, I think we're just gonna end it with the patent Kirby Crackle. Oi, oi, oi. All right. Kirby Crackle, Kirby Crackle. Oi, oi, oi. The good, the bad, the ugly, man. We had some good books. Everybody showed up, represented. Shout outs to Pokan Joe, first time battler on the collector club. Hylia for being first on board. And everybody else coming back in the rear, dude. I appreciate all y'all, brother. Stay tuned. Oi, oi, oi. Kirby's oi, the king. Oi. Kirby's the greatest. Oi, Don't oi. ever forget it. Oi, oi.